uh, move to strike the last word. Gentleman is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, uh, for your leadership, and I want to, in particular, thank the chairman of the subcommittee, Representative Cicilline, and the ranking member, Mr. Buck, for their leadership as we embarked on a very thorough and comprehensive 18-month investigation into uh, the concentration of uh, power within the digital marketplace. I think uh, that the bills we are considering today are important, and I know we are going to have robust debate and certainly look forward uh, to, uh, to that debate today. I'd like to take a moment to talk about my bill, in particular, the bill that we are considering first this morning. Uh, this bill, in my view, uh, is a clarion call to our regulators, uh, to our enforcement agencies, namely the FTC, to step up and do what is necessary to protect our small businesses, to protect innovation, to protect consumers, and ultimately, to protect our economy. Before I was elected to the United States Congress, I served as a regulator in my home state of Colorado, leading our state's consumer protection agency, the counterpart to the SEC and CFPB. And that experience uh, certainly uh, gave me uh, the underpinning in terms of the knowledge of knowing just how important it is for our regulators and our enforcement agencies to have the resources that they need to do the job that they are charged to do under the law. And this bill would accomplish precisely that. It would modernize a filing fee structure that has not been changed in any substantive way in 20 years. Literally, these fees have not been uh, adjusted in 20 years. And what is interesting about the approach that we have taken, and I thank my colleague, Representative Sparts uh, from the state of Indiana for her leadership in this regard, uh, is that this bill is not a one-size-all approach. It increases the fees on substantial mergers, mergers of transactions that total over $160 million, but lowers the filing fees for small businesses. That, to me, is a common sense, reasonable, prudent approach that ultimately will ensure that the FTC has additional resources to be able uh, to do the job, as I said, that they are charged to do under the law. This is a bipartisan bill. It passed the United States Senate unanimously. Senator Klobuchar and Senator Grassley led the charge in the Senate. I would hope that every member of this committee, Republican and Democrat, would agree that lowering fees for small businesses is a good step forward. And with that, Mr. Chairman, I would uh, implore my colleagues to vote in favor of both this amendment and ultimately final passage of the bill. And with that, I would yield back. The gentleman yields back for what purpose does Ms. Sparks 